Have you gotten to the point where you're playing League of Legends but you just can't seem to have fun with the game anymore? Do you find that you no longer experience that feeling of joy and adventure that you got when you first started playing this game? Are you looking for a way to have fun but be potentially completely fucking useless the whole game? Well then AP Nocturne is just the character for you. Hello darkness my old friend I've come to talk with you again now you're probably wondering, hey Darkmain, why would you ever build Nocturne AP? What's the benefit of that? Why would you not build him AD? Well, check this out. You wanna know why you build Nocturne AP? Look, the AP scaling percentage on his E is as high as the percentage of people who work at Walmart that hate themselves. So obviously, building him AP is clearly the better way to do it. Are you unable to satisfy your partner in bed? Well, statistics show that 100% of people who play AP Nocturne don't have this problem, because they aren't actually in a relationship. Now, when you play this guy, it's important to start with your W, because I accidentally clicked on it first. I mean, because you can use it to block all sorts of abilities, like so. FUCK! You wanna know what Nocturne's ult is? I'll tell you what it is, it's a, it's a dash move, so you can use it to get the fuck out of where you currently are, and you can dash to somewhere else. And I think that that is something that we can all relate to. You know the scenario, you're fuck. you're in your room, you're watching some weird porn, I don't know, a dude's fucking horses or some shit, you know, just as an example. But, but then just as, just after you've covered yourself in honey, and stuck your dick into your pink math turbo fleshlight, you know, once again, just as an example, or just hypothetically, uh, d just as you do that, somebody walks in on you, and now you're thinking, oh no, if only I could dash away from this situation. Well, with Nocturne, you can do exactly that. Also, you should probably lock the door. Before I played AP Nocturne, I looked like this. After playing AP Nocturne, I looked like this. But now that you have your ultimate, you can perform Lesson 1, the Scion Nocturne Extravaganza. It's an unbeatable combo. What you do is you get a Scion on your team, and you both ult the same guy, and it's a guaranteed kill every time. Plus, you get bonus points for filling the enemy with fear by having this... <laughs> And this Darkness. play right next to each other. And it sounds like this. Darkness. You ever experienced nausea, back pain, breathing problems, stroke, or diarrhea? Then it fucking sucks to be you. Lesson two, you gotta make the best out of every scenario. So you accidentally use your ult, but the target you wanna dash to isn't in range. It doesn't matter, just dash to this guy instead. A kill's a kill, you know? You just gotta go ahead and do that. And even if you waste both your ult and flash, but you still can't reach the guy, it's fine. You, you, you've done the spooky part, which makes the loud noise, and that scares the enemy and lowers their morale. And that's all that you need to do. And you thought that AP Nocturne was already great. But wait, there's more. Now, for the low, low price of $9.99, you can buy the official Ghost Nocturne DLC Expansion Pack. When you have this, dying is a thing of the past. Because as soon as you die, you come right back to life, and you can keep wreaking havoc. And there's nothing they can do. See, when you were AD, nobody was afraid of you. But with AP Nocturne, everyone is fucking terrified of your tendrils of fear. So contact your doctor for a prescription to AP Nocturne with 0% APR financing. Side effects of playing AP Nocturne might be drowsiness, fevers, ulcers, mild kleptomania, breathing, BITCH! Headaches, liking the color brown, long hair, suddenly breaking out into show tunes, BOOM! Pursuing an English major, eating granola bars, painting pictures of furniture, sleepwalking, FUCK! DESTROYED! A 50% chance of a 200% chance of constipation, and all these. So play a game of AP Nocturne and it can look a little something like the Fuck. So when you play AP Nocturne, you too can do stuff like the Shit. So go out and play a game of AP Nocturne, and you can- Motherfucking- This isn't working! What do you mean it isn't working? It's not fucking working, dude! It's not! Dude, come on, you have to keep going. No, this is bullshit! This shit doesn't work! Who the fuck would play this? It's fucking garbage! Dude, you're almost done, just come on, just keep- No! Fuck it! I'm done! Alright, this sucks! Fucking roll the- just roll the next segment, alright? Roll the next part. Just do it. <sighs> alright, just roll the next part. Just roll it! Roll the next segment. Hi there, and welcome to a new segment on this show called Learning About Our Friends on the Rift. 
Now I find that if you want to get good at this game, it's important to know just a little bit of information about the creatures that you're going to meet while playing. So today we have a very special guest. Everyone, please welcome my good friend, Scuttle Crab. Yeah, all right, yeah. Uh, all right, hello, Mr. Crab. Thank you for coming on the show. Now, um, I guess the main question that we all want to know is uh, what goes through your mind all the time? You know, people seem to see you as a very quiet, reserved man. And I think what we all want to know is just a little bit about what goes on inside your head. So just hit me with it. What have you got, man? Heil fucking Hitler. Dude, what the fuck? Alright, fuck all the bullshit, I'm back, and I'm ready to make shitty puns, mediocre plays, and trash tier comedy. So let's fucking go. Alright, lesson three, what you do is you let her hit you a couple times, and you let her get you, like, pretty low, and then you have to run away, but as you're running away, you have to think of, like, a good, cool pun to say while you're doing that. Like, um, uh, I'm sorry it was so hard to kill me, or, um, if you were the flood, I... It's, it's like, I escaped from you on Noah's Dark, because, you know, he has to do with, like, darkness and stuff. Um, yeah. Those ones aren't very good, to be honest. They, I should probably think of better ones. Oh, oh, but then, you see, what you do is you, uh, you can use your ult to get to her, and then you can just, uh, you can just kill her, and then, I guess, I guess, I guess I really nocturned that fight around. Oh, Rengar, you want to get away? Come on, man, that's ludicrous. Yeah, there he is. It's pretty cool. But man, trying to get away from me, that's just crazy. You know, I'm sorry I had to do it, man, but you know what they say. You gotta break a few cats to make an omelet that tastes like cats. Yeah. Wow, you wanna look- I wanna tell these guys a secret. Uh, I'm not actually a human being. I'm a bat, owl, and or raccoon. You wanna know why? Because I'm nocturnal. Get it? Because that's his name? Because it's, uh, actually, now that I think about it, that's probably why they named him Nocturne in the first place. Because he has to do with sleep in the nighttime. So I guess I just brought the joke full circle. Now you want to know what's really ludicrous? Now fuck you! I already made that joke! Fuck out of here! But yeah, you want to know what else is crazy? The fact that these people truly believe that they can kill a ghostly ghost. See, that's the thing about ghosts, you know, uh, th they're a lot like people who refuse to color their hair, uh, because they don't die. Wow, this Cho'Gath thinks he can kill me too, well, unfortunately for him, I am a ghost and I don't die. Man, now even Rengar wants to kill me, see, I don't get it, why can't these people understand that I'm just a ghost and I can't die, I mean, come on. Oh, Rengar, you see, you just don't get it, I'm just, I'm a ghost and I can't die, and... Motherfucking piece of shit. Oh, he's, he's right there! He's, he's right- Oh, good job, good job, you know. Wow, you know, this game really is ludicrous. Fuck off! So remember to play yourself a game of AP Nocturne for mediocre times for you and horrible times for everybody else on your team. For more information, you can contact me at 1-800-this-isn't-my-actual-phone-number.com backslash AP Nocturne.vlc. See you later. We'll travel near and we'll travel far Toot toot, chugga chugga, big red car We're gonna ride the whole day long Uh, hey guys, it's the end of the video and I figured you've already seen all the important shit so I just, I'd say this here Um, first of all, thanks for all the fucking growth that my channel's got and that's fucking awesome I don't even know how to, like, thank you guys for that, that's amazing And, um, second of all uh, I've been looking in the comments section and I'm seeing a lot of hate towards certain other people on the internet. I think you guys know the people that I'm referring to. And I just want to say, let's try to not disrespect other people, alright? Like, because I don't really have any hate for any of those guys, even though people think that I'm kind of ripping off them. And at the same time, I'm not really doing this to compare myself to others. I'm doing this because... I really enjoy the feeling I get when I make you guys laugh, and I know that sounds corny as shit and fucking stupid, but it's true. So, just, uh, from now on, if you're gonna think about talking shit about some person, uh, on the internet that's not me, just think twice about it, and, you know, just try to refrain from that, because I don't want to generate that kind of hate on my channel, you know? That's really all it is. Um, also, for the next, uh, two weeks or so, I'm gonna be out of town, so... No videos for a little while, but I'm gonna come back, and I'm gonna do some shit, and it's gonna be great. I don't really know what exactly it is, but uh, I'm gonna do it, and then, yeah, it's gonna be great. So, 
Just wait for that. I'll be back. See you later.